occasionally when you get pieces or parts um, they're gonna have some wrinkles in them uh, due to the FedEx guy tossing them around or whatever when they leave here they they'll be wrinkle free and everything and ready to go but once in a while either your dog's gonna lay on them or you're gonna set them in the corner or you'll put something on them which I highly discourage but you will get some wrinkles when you do that uh, even stacking parts on top of each other these plastic back ones the plastic can actually put a little wrinkle or crease in it when you put it in the cab it's actually gonna come out once that cab gets out in the sun and the and it gets a little warmer but if you're in a big hurry you got a customer coming to pick this thing up you're a dealer all you need to do is a little handheld steamer most people have one of these at home and uh, you take that steam I don't know if you can see this wrinkle right here but there's a crease right there and, the, and, and they'll come out pretty quick just a little bit of steam and that's gone you can do it prior to putting it in your cap or after it's in the cap there's another wrinkle right here. You see that one? Do the same thing there. Get those wrinkles out. Almost like magic. When that thing's installed, it's going to sit like that. That wrinkle's completely gone. A little crease in this corner. When that thing is installed, it'll be down level. That crease will be gone. So, pretty easy to get wrinkles out of them. Um, be careful if you use a, a metal iron with the steamer on it where you push the button and the steam shoots out. You get that metal on this vinyl, it'll, sometimes it'll melt it. If you want to use that method, take and put a piece of fabric on here, cotton old t-shirt, uh, shop rag, and then go ahead and put your iron on top of that, give it a push, shoot the steam through. But keep that metal iron off of this vinyl. Pro tip.